Sergeant Dick Burney, front and center. Oh! Neat bunch of selectees. You know, I was a selectee once. <laughs> Tell me, Dick, how do you like the Army now? I said, how do you like the Army now? It's a military secret. Well, what's the matter with the Army? Eh, it's a little too feminine. Feminine? Certainly, with all those women auxiliaries, like the AWVS, the Red Cross, the Father Duffy Canteen, the Waves, the Wags, the Woo Woo's, the Wow Wow's, and not forgetting the WAACs. Well, that's fine. That shows the women are really patriotic. Oh, maybe so. But when I come home from camp on a three-day pass after slaving all week over a hot gun, <laughs> I'm ready to go. I got a box of flowers on the one arm and a box of candy on the other arm. I run down the street like an idiot, ignoring all the lights. I run into my hotel, run up the elevator, knock on the bell, ring the door, the door opens, and there's my beautiful wife. I look at her, and she looks at me. I look at her, and she looks at me. Well, why don't you kiss her? I can't. She's a first lieutenant. <laughs> Oh, she's a whack. That's beside the point. You know, the worst part of it is I got to get permission from the top sergeant to even talk to her. Well, what's tough about that? The top sergeant's my mother-in-law. <laughs> <laughs> the top sergeant's my mother-in-law. <laughs> Maybe he hasn't got a mother-in-law. But I'm going to get even. I'm going to take him out on the rifle range and show him how to use a rifle. You're going to show your wife how to shoot a rifle? My mother-in-law, too. Same bullet. Well, you have to be a marksman for that. Really? Now, take me, for instance. I'm one of the best marksmen in the country. What makes you think you're one of the best marksmen in the country? Well, I'll give you an instance. I'd like to hear an instance. The other day I went hunting in the woods. There in front of me I saw a big, beautiful tree. Seated on one limb of the tree were 14 birds. 14 birds? I'll be right back. 14 birds were seated on one limb of the tree. <laughs> he don't care about nothing. He looks like a guy from my draft board. <laughs> Everybody in. <laughs> You heard of the March of Time? There's his brother, Waste of Time. <laughs> <laughs> I caught you. Ooh, it's alive. <laughs> Come on, wipe the smile off your face. Come on, get serious. Get serious. Think of your salary. That did it. <laughs> now, what were you saying about the birds? There were 14 birds in one limb. Yeah? I looked at my rifle, I had only one bullet. Oh, my. Now, my objective was to get the 14 birds of the one bullet. Oh, you can't do it. I did it. How? I took my rifle, aimed, fired. The bullet split the limb. The 14 birds got their feet caught in the limb. I walked over, sawed off the limb, put it across my shoulder, walked home with the 14 birds, and it wasn't a good day for hunting that day either. <laughs> you want to hear some real shooting? Yes. Well, spread out, make it look like a big regiment. Last week, I was out in the woods hunting. There in front of me, I saw a big, beautiful deer. I picked up my rifle and aimed a 500. I heard noise on my right. What do you think it was? What? 500 wild ducks. Well, I didn't want the deer. I wanted those ducks. I picked up my rifle and aimed a 500. I heard noise on my left. What do you think it was? What? 500 wild geese. I didn't want the deer. I didn't want the ducks. I wanted those geese. I picked up my rifle and aimed a fire when a snake about five feet long jumped right up in front of me. Boy, I changed my plans completely. I didn't want the deer. I didn't want the ducks. I didn't want the geese. I wanted that snake. I picked up my rifle, aimed, fired. The barrel split in two. One barrel went to the right, killed 500 ducks. One barrel went to the left, killed 500 geese. The bullet went straight ahead, shot the deer. The Ram out of the gun went down the snake, so I choked him to death. The rebound of the gun hit me in the shoulder. I fell over in the river, come up my boots full of fish. I stooped over to take a fish out of my boot, and what do you think happened? What? A button snapped off my coat and killed the rabbit, <laughs> and it wasn't a good day for hunting that day either. <laughs> I'd have killed more, but I was tired that day. <laughs> I'll go quietly. <laughs>